She's the curious 10-year-old discovering a new world through the bushes near his home. He's the teenager who makes that world his own. I took pride in, in learning the golf course because I was ashamed that I had to drop out of school. And um, uh, early on, you know, uh, I, I had said to myself, this is going to be my diploma, this, this course. He's the voice of wisdom, helping one of the world's greatest golfers make magic at the Masters. He is Carl Jackson, a man who started caddying at Augusta National Golf Club at age 11 and caddied in his first Masters at 14. Uh, whatever I've achieved over there has been due to Carl. He made me yearn for knowledge about that golf course. Carl Jackson has lived and breathed Augusta National for most of his life. He walked from the shadow of poverty into the light of victory and stood proudly on golf's greatest stage. On his incredible journey, he's met billionaires and presidents and stars. But nothing, nothing means more to Carl Jackson than his beloved Augusta National, where he can read the greens and the players too. He's a great observationist, meaning he can look at a player uh, and watch how they are playing on a given day and, and sense what they're doing right and what may be uh, a weakness that day. Who else could Ben Crenshaw count on to help him master the Masters in 1984? He knew when we first met that this was my favorite place to play. It was the most fascinating place to play. It was the most meaningful place uh, to play. During the 1995 Masters, it was Carl who pulled Crenshaw out from...